M0FXB, welcome back to the channel. Today we're looking at the BTEC cable that I recently purchased. This is the BTEC K1 or now the K2, it's the same thing. It converts a twin pin connector, which is here, your typical Bofun, Kenwood, Quashang, all the usual type devices that we like tinkering with, to have an APRS output. So you will receive on 144800 in the UK, you will receive your APRS, okay? But in the USA, it's 144900. And then it will send it out through this cable. And then you can use apps like, this is a new one I've been using called APRS Pro, which I absolutely love and just discovered. It works on your iPhone and your uh, iPad, as you can see. It's got my call sign in there. I just paid for the extra subscription so I can transmit. Uh, I haven't done much transmitting yet. Um, I don't think I'm even on there yet, but I'll send out a couple of packets soon, but look at that map. And then when you go to the menu, look at all these different functions. And it does say, if you go to the TX warning, it will say to you, um, if you press transmit, this app will send an individual APRS message to all stations. There you are. I've just done it. <laughs> the warning messages were sent to 45 stations. Oh, okay. Well, I wasn't meant to send a warning, but at least it will show up on APRS FI. Or if we go back, it should show up here that I sent out a warning. Um, but anyway, I'll let them know that it was just a test. Look at that. As you zoom in, you get all the map. It's just really cool. Where's my warning then? Not seeing a warning yet. Is it? Because I'm around. You think that I'm around here. I'm about here. Sort of looking at this. And no sign of me sending a warning station. Anyway, um, so I just thought I'd show you. And then here you'll see my got APRS Droid, which we I think is a very popular and a good app as well. I've got the TRS cable. So at the other end of the BTEC cable, you've got TRS. And you can plug that into uh, different applications like WinLink, of course, APRS. I have got myself a TRS to USB cable here. That didn't come in that in that kit. I definitely plan to learn all about it. There's quite a few videos that they've made uh, on this product and on the APRS Pro, APRS FI, plenty of videos out there. So I thought I'd just show it you and say, I've got, I definitely plan to be, to, I'm gonna be making several videos learning this product, but it's literally gonna be about 30 videos uh, by the time I learn it. We've got messages there, info, I've had a message. I need assistance, please call me. Um, so there you are. At least they know I'm I'm out there and about. Um, so I'm gonna just gonna go hi and just go enter, and it sends it PTT. Now remember, you can't send messages if you haven't paid the subscription. So let me have a go. Unless it was actually was it me needing the assistance? There you go. No, <laughs> you can see that I've literally just downloaded this. Uh, so yeah, give me some tips. I'm just tapping away as you do. Go back, let's go back to the map. I'm getting lost in this. So what you can do is on your settings on your APRS Droid, tap this, go to preferences, and then look down to your, you've got to put your call sign in, you get a APRS number, mine's in there already. Connection preferences, the one that's recommended is on when you're doing it this way is actually audio AFSK and when I plugged it in and put an antenna on my little bowfang here I started to get messages. So antenna on, cables plugged in, plugged into the the phone as well. Smartphone isn't it? I use that for Zello. It was about sixty pound on AliExpress and it just does everything, you know, like Zello, TeamSpeak, Echo Link, Peanut, all your favourite apps. So we go send position. And now it's receiving, it's actually receiving from this antenna here. If I get my FT5 here, just got it there, and I tell it to beacon, so we go F menu, then beacon, it should appear here if it's working correctly. 144800, M0FXP5, stop tracking, start tracking, let's do it again, F menu. There you go, it just appeared. So obviously I, I'm just, you know, I've been on this 10 minutes. So cut me some, cut me some slack. You know, I learn in front of you. I'm not actually trying to teach anyone anything. 
I'm just learning, I'm discovering new radios, apps, and I'm having great fun and sharing that with you. Thanks for watching my YouTube channel. Bye for now. All the best.